Hey there, it's Jazzy on Wednesday. For the first time ever, I actually have a video on time. Um, alright. Well, I got a lot of things to talk about here. And I wrote it on a post-it, so I wouldn't forget. Um, Elena proposed a challenge was to film yourself in different angles and one standing. And to be honest, I'm not going to do that. That's way too much effort. Alright, so the first question was, if I could meet any famous person, dead or alive, who would it be? And the first person that automatically popped into my head was John Frusciante, who was the guitar player for the Red Hot Chili Peppers. Um, when I thought up about it some more, I realized that if I did meet him, I would just be like a teeny bopper, like have like a, you know, like a teeny bopper reaction. Like, oh my god, it's John Frusciante, I love you so much! And yeah, that'd be kind of cheesy, so um, yeah, I actually, um, if I was to meet someone, I'd like to meet Tegan and Sarah because I think I would actually be able to hang out with them and actually have like an enjoyable conversation with them and stuff because I've seen them in concert last summer and they were, yeah, really, really funny. They were able to interact, like the way they interacted with each other, like they were joking about and making fun of each other and stuff like that. And yeah, I know I have that part of me and I think, yeah, we'd be able to like uh, hang out with each other and have fun. Um, Sarah, I think you pull off the little over nanny look really, really well. I think your hair looks really cool. Um, let's see what else was asked. Oh yeah, Cad. All right, Cad, start putting five dollars in that jar because that was an easy question. The song that you had on your video was "Living Room" by Tegan and Sarah. Um, oh yeah, and your challenge a few weeks ago was to draw some pictures and show it to you guys. And as promised, I have some pictures for you, and I'll show it to you right now. Oh, and as a side note, this was a really big challenge for me because I don't have any drawing skills whatsoever. But I give it my best shot, so here we go. Alright, so the first set of pictures I have here are each and every members of the June Bugs. This here is Cecilia with her cat Mischief. This is Sarah. And we have Cad here. And Jess Lee. Don't worry, we didn't forget about you. Hopefully you'll get your camera fixed. So you can come back to us. And last but not least, Elena! Here is a bumblebee. And then, these next set of pictures, I ended up drawing some cross-animal, cross-plant pictures. Like, for example, um, this is a Venus flytrap and a peacock. And then I have um, a tortoise and a hare. And this one is a moose, an iguana, which makes an iguana moose. This picture I drew here is a couple walking romantically across the beach. Um, I purposely didn't draw their heads to symbolize that when it comes to a relationship, gender doesn't matter. What matters is that they love each other. I drew this heart at work on a post-it. Um, around it, it says, my heart, your skin, this love I'm in. It's a song by the Red Hot Chili Peppers called Charlie. This last picture I drew here is um, a background full of trees, and in front of the trees is a pencil that says, I miss being a tree. Alright, I will answer um, the rest of the questions you girls asked um, on the next video because America's Next Top Model's on and I want to watch that right now. But before I go, I have a special shout out to our latest subscriber here, Raven! I even drew a picture. Alright, I'm out now. Talk to you guys later. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.